everybody. Hope you're doing well. My name is John Phelps with Techmetric. And what I want to show you today is how to get the My Place for Parts integration set up inside of Techmetric. Now, it's important to note that you may need to have the shop owner, shop manager, somebody in an admin position that has certain permissions in order to get this integration turned on and active. But once you're inside of Techmetric, you're going to come over here to this left hand side of this menu bar and come on down to shop settings. You click on shop settings and then I want you to go to the top right where it says integrations. Once you click on integrations, you can scroll down and you can find my place for parts. From there, click manage. Now, assuming they already have you set up as a vendor, you simply select the vendor that's necessary. If not, you will have to add a new vendor, in which case you'll put the store's name, your name, contact information, the address, all of that necessary information to add that vendor in place. If not, you can simply select the store that's already set up in there. And then from there, you can come up top to integrations, click on the edit pencil, and you can add the My Place for Parts seller and buyer's ID. From there, you can hit save. And then at that point, shops can begin using the My Place for Parts integration, which point you click on the RO, you come on down to the estimate that you're working in, you click add part from my place for parts, and then the old familiar screen will begin to populate. It's gonna automatically transfer the VIN, your make and model. And from there, they can begin searching for the parts that they need, transfer that information back into Techmetric, and then once approved, one click, they can order those parts without even having to go back into that integration uh, in the estimate screen. Now, if that isn't enough, when you're in the shop, they're going to have this big old question mark icon. So if all else fails, click on that, click how to articles and videos, and then simply search my place for parts integration. And then there you have it. You've got all of that information right there, some quick links, and then step by step on how to get this set up. Hope that gives you plenty of information on how to get your shops easily set up with my place for parts. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and to share it with the rest of your team. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you would like to see more helpful videos for auto repair shops. Have a wonderful day.